she's blocking her ability to see what needs to be um, changed in her life. Okay. She's resisting it. Okay, so she's resisting seeing the change and then obviously actioning the change. Mm-hmm. Okay, why is she resisting? Because she's afraid. Yeah. Of the amount of change. Mm-hmm. Okay. But if she doesn't start making changes, she, I assume she'll still get the migraines, won't she? Yes. Mm -hmm. All right, so she's got to start being open to change and flexible and mm. go through with it, doesn't she? Yes. Mm -hmm. can, you, can you explain the process behind her actually physically getting the migraines? Or how does that... How does that process, whole process arise that she actually gets a, a physical migraine? Like what's the actual workings involved? You know, from, mm. from start to finish kind of thing. What elements are involved? Mm. It's... It's subconscious. Mm -hmm. And it's a fear of doing what she knows she needs to do. Mm -hmm. Tension. Yeah. Overwhelmment. Mm hmm. And not. Giving voice to it. And not what, sorry? Not giving voice to it. Okay, yep. Or allowing it. Mm hmm. Carrying. Uh, some. The manifestation. Of the pain of ignoring that. Mm, okay. Okay. Mm. So every time she gets a migraine, it's is it yeah, is it the the energy build up from all of that, or is it is it more of a message from the subconscious, or is it both? It's both. Okay. So, just say that she gets the migraine coming on. Is there a quick way that she can disable the migraine from coming on? Would it be to, well, what what would you say to that? Once the migraine is coming on, it's too late. Okay. But to prevent any mm. migraines in the future, she needs to start overcoming mm. the fear and listening to the voice and giving giving it some yes. action yes. Mm -hmm. before it even gets to that stage. Yes. Okay. All right. So she's got to start taking action soon, and she won't have to worry about migraines. Correct? Some. Mhm. Mm Others might take a bit longer. Okay. Her system. needs to recalibrate. Mm -hmm.